Welcome back. Whether you remember it or not, you dream every single night. Now, sometimes they're happy, oftentimes sad, often bizarre. According to Healthline, they're a normal part of sleep and something we spend one third of our life doing. And some fun facts about dreams. You're more likely to remember your dreams on weekends or days when you sleep in because each episode of REM sleep is longer than the last. Also, longer dreams occur in the morning hours. Also, did you know that we don't all dream in color? Around 12% of people dream in black and white. Now let's dig deeper into what our dreams actually mean, if anything. Joining us now to dive into the topic is Jessica Herbert with Blue Star <laughs> Gaia. Welcome, Jessica. Thank you. And so what do really, what do dreams mean? I guess that's a big question. That's a big question <laughs> that for you. That is a very big question. Mm -hmm. So for the most part, our, our dreams, you know, are a state when we're, um, exploring the energetic workings of ourself mm. in the universe mm. and so you know just as you know in waking life it's real life dreaming life is also real mm -hmm. and so we're mostly working with areas of like our our mind like our intellect or areas of our soul mm -hmm. um, and so for example if we dream about buildings in general they're very symbolic of our psyche mm. which wow. is like the combination of our various levels of consciousness including mm -hmm. our intuition as well as areas that are not in our awareness mm. Mm. Yeah, so how do we know um, what information we can take as accurate? Because some stuff is really bizarre. <laughs> um, so how do we know what, what we can take and, and actually, you know, hold on to the meaning? Well, in our dreams, you know, the dream itself is always accurate. It's mm -hmm. our interpretation sure. of it that's, that gets a little tricky. Mm -hmm. um, one of my go-to resources is a book by author Rosemary Ellen Geely. It was published in like 1995. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it doesn't have everything in there, but um, so far it's the most accurate thing I have found that resonates with me. Mm. Oh, so you can look through there at different, yep. s find the symbols. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, and I think that, yeah. um, you know, it's, uh, I, have, I have a friend who, because um, I, I have, I was telling you a little mm -hmm. bit before, I have crazy dreams all oh, the time. Yes. And um, my uh, my good friend always is just like, Nick, I wish I had dreams like yours. <laughs> and and yeah, weren't like, you in yeah. Oprah's, or was Oprah in your garden or were you in Oprah's garden? Which no, one? no, I was in, um, I was in Beyonce's oh, was garden. Oh, okay. it was Beyonce's Watching garden. Baby Blue, it was babysitting. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. But um, uh, no, my friend yeah. just has like the most, like really just mundane dreams, oh, yeah. you know? And so mm -hmm. I feel like, you know, like how can, um, how can somebody, um, you know, is it possible to like, um, like learn more and expand like your mm -hmm. like awareness of your dreams to oh, like, yes. you know, really gauge a For lot sure. of it? Cause yeah. Yes. How does that work? Well, um, part of it is like intention. Mm. Like some people, you know, go to bed with the intention to just get a good night's sleep. Mm. But some people could also set their intention to, um, remember their dreams in ways that they can know and understand. Mm. Yeah, let's mm -hmm. talk about uh, nightmares, of course, we have to talk about oh, that. Yes. Um, and that's a whole different world. Oh, well, not really, because nightmares are dreams. Well, right. And yeah. it, um, in my worldview, there isn't really a bad dream, but the dreams that are really, really uncomfortable, mm -hmm. scary, yes. awkward, things like that, they're dreams that are intended to grab our attention towards something. Mm. And also, as we're going through those emotions and feelings, we're receiving healing to those mm. in the dream. And so it's almost like uh, it's uh, really, when you have like those, uh, those, those nightmares, it's mm -hmm. drawing attention to those yes. aspects that yeah. really that your, your internal body and yeah. your, um, like your relationships are just like, mm -hmm. hey, pay attention to this. Like, right. like whatever yes. your interpretation of that exactly. is is positive at that point. Exactly. Yeah. So where can um, where can people find you? Well, I am very active on social media, mm -hmm. especially Facebook. Mm -hmm. I have a website, um, bluestargaia.com, and mm -hmm. I'm also on Linktree. Um, and I also um, provide services at Christie's Crystals. Um, so I teach classes there Tuesday nights, and the Saturday I'll be there noon to five doing um, spiritual readings and Reiki. All awesome. right, all right. Well, thank you so much oh, uh, for joining you. us today. Oh, it was a joy. It was, and we'll be right back after the break.